Bro, why in the hell when you live alone is there always a mess? Always. I just made the actual biggest mess. I don't know why I struggle so much to like do the bare minimum. All right guys, so I got a random package in the mail and I have no idea who it's from. My toes are in this. I have no idea who it's from or what it could be, but it's from Dior, so I don't know. I literally have no idea who this could be from. Okay. okay. Perfume samples. Shut up! Oh my gosh! I'm gonna cry! Who the hell bought me this? Bro, what? I've been wanting these so bad. Who the hell sent me this? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna cry. What the hell? Who? Who? I have literally been like wanting these two items. So bad. Oh my gosh. Do you see how pretty this is? Yeah. Maybe it was for you. See if it was her. Because if it's not, that's a little strange. That's not good. Oh, at least it smells good. Wow, this smells really good. Y'all, I would, I would do some things to get a freaking. It is from her. I'm gonna cry, guys. For everyone watching this, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I love you so much. I'm gonna cry. Oh my gosh. What I was saying, I really want grapes right now. Like green grapes. Oh my gosh. I would do some things for green grapes right now. These are really good. I just had a whole breakdown. I don't know why. But I'm eating this recess. It's making me feel better. And I'm gonna sit here and edit my YouTube video. Cause that needs to go up in like three hours. So hopefully we can get it done. I want to go swimming really, really bad. I might go swimming after this. Well, welcome to the 33rd thousandth time of me saying that I'm having a bad day, but today sucked. Today was awful. I cried about 50 million times, and I literally bawled my eyes out, but... Um, I wasn't going to even post a video tomorrow, because I don't, I don't even think I filmed anything today. And then I was like, you know what, even if it's four minutes long, I should still post something. I don't think it's fair to be like, I'm going to post every single day and then not fucking post every single day. So, here we are. Um, I was having a really shitty day. Like, I told Jack earlier, I was like, all I want to do is jump in the pool right now. Like, I just want to jump in the pool and like swim around. <laughs> it sounds so dumb. But I was like, I just want to go in a pool so bad. So he was like, okay. So, and then... He he hates sushi, but he was like, 
let me take you to dinner. So we're going we're going to sushi later, which I'm really happy about because obviously I'm going to eat a lot, but I'm just really excited about like the getting ready part because I love taking a long time to get ready and like I don't know, it's like therapy for me, you know? So you get out of the bathroom, we're gonna go down and we're gonna go swimming before we have to shower because today is a hair washing day and I was like, if I'm gonna wash my hair before I get ready for dinner, I wanna go in the pool. So it's currently seven and our reservation's for nine. Um, so I'm probably gonna go in there for like 20 minutes, maybe max. I just wanna like go swim around and like chill in the hot tub for a second and then we'll come back up and get ready. We're going to dinner at the same place that I went with my friends last time. The one in the video that was four minutes long so you didn't even see my friends or the place that I went to, which is annoying, but we're going back to that same place and it was really, really good and yeah. All right, so I really, this lighting is, why is it so scary? But I really wanted to, I got this new foundation. It's not my foundation, it's a color correcting full coverage cream. It's this one by It Cosmetics. I've seen it everywhere and I think my mom's used it a lot, but I really wanna try it. So I'm gonna try that today. And then I found this, cause I was looking for, I always use this Fenty moisturizer. Um, it looks like this and it's the best thing ever. It's so hydrating and it's like a, a great primer for, for like before your makeup. But I wanted to find something else to use underneath just so it would be like more, more because I've just been one, losing a lot of hydration today, especially in my face. And I just feel like gross. So I found this Mario Badescu caffeine eye cream. I know Mario Badescu is not the best for you, but I really want to try this eye cream because if it does wonders, it does wonders, you know. So let's try this. Um, I'm excited. And then we have all of our Dior products that we're going to try today. So I'm very excited actually to do this makeup. I think this might be the most therapeutic thing to exist. Um, besides therapy, but that's a different conversation. It looks like this. And I'm just going to get a little bit and then put it underneath. Okay, it's really cold. Oh my, oh wow. You know what? I really like the way that this feels. This feels amazing. Wow, that was really nice. My face feels very alive right now. I wish I could put this all over my face. And then we're gonna try this right now. So I think I'm gonna put it on my hand, a little bit on my hand. Okay, we're gonna start with this much. I have no idea how pigmented this is or how like full coverage. So I just put literally the tiniest dot to ever exist. I don't know if the brush is my favorite thing. Like, that was nothing though. I literally used up that entire thing for nothing. Okay. Okay, I got a lot bigger dollop, if you will. I literally grabbed this while I was in line at Sephora to like pay. Like you know how they have those like a bunch of mini things? I literally grabbed it and it happened to be my shade and actually like worked really well. Okay. Wow, you know what? That actually looks really good. Oh my gosh. It's also very full coverage. I'm surprised. Like, how's it looking? Oh, oh. I don't know what the hell happened, but it's starting to patch up. This side looks good and this side looks bad. So I don't know what the hell I did differently on both sides. My face just was a little more cakier, but I really like it. I like the feel of it. It does feel a little more heavy. I will still stand by this foundation till the day I die, the Fenty foundation. I've just been trying to like broaden my horizons because I'm almost out of that one. And I was like, if I'm gonna buy a whole new one, I might as well try different products until, like in case there's one that's better than that one. But so far, no one's got that one beat. Fenty products, top tier. All right, I'm gonna do the rest of my face and then I'll come back when I'm ready. All right guys, it's finally time. Oh, we're trying the Dior blush. Okay, I'm so excited. You don't even know. Okay. <gasps> oh, 
Holy crap, it's so pretty. Okay, I want to use like, a clean brush for this. I can take a little, oh, I don't even want to like get it, anything on it. Oh, okay. I used um, Rare Beauty, like a few dots underneath, but. Oh my gosh, it's pretty, okay. This lighting is a little weird. I know I look really dramatic on this side, but I promise you it's not that intense in person. But this blush, oh my gosh. I'm gonna cry. It's literally beautiful. Holy crap. Like, wow. That exceeded my expectations by a million. I'm gonna finish my makeup and then when I get to the lips and then we'll try the oil. It's time. So I just put a little bit of like, I use this and I just like put the smallest amount and then just rub it around. But um, we're gonna try the duo lip oil. Okay, so. I hate open, opening like new lip glosses and stuff because then it messes up the Oh my gosh. Are you kidding? This is the best thing I have ever used on my lips in my entire life. Holy crap. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Okay, well this is the makeup and I'm gonna do my hair now. Alright, it's outfit time now. Um, I'm gonna wait to do my hair because it's still wet. So let's pick out an outfit. It's a little bit cold outside and this place isn't too fancy. It's like, eh, but there is a dress code. So I'm thinking I was, I wanted to wear this oversized jacket or sweater, but I don't think it's the move. I was thinking, imagine this with me, would you? Imagine this jacket with the little skirt and then boots. You know what, I'm gonna try it. I just don't know if, what skirt should I wear? Is, is it a black skirt type thing? Let me try this on. Um, it's giving stripper, stripper prostitute, but like school teacher on top. I kind of hate it. The boots are definitely throwing it off a lot. It's just, and I, the sweater, I hate the sweater. We're gonna change this entire outfit because I hate it. <laughs> All right, I decided to just dress up this really casual sundress. Um, I don't know if it's the move, but I'm also wearing boots with it. It doesn't really match, but also, like, it doesn't really matter. So this is the fit. I have to do my hair now. I'm gonna have to leave in like five minutes, so I gotta get that going. I'm probably just gonna end up having to blow dry it out, so straighten it, basically. Yeah. Real quick fit check before we go. You go first. All right, Carhartt. H&M, Forever 21, uh, no idea. And then I got Air Force Ones on. All right, this jacket is from Princess Polly, I think. The dress is from PacSun. Boots are Zara. And then, yeah, bags loops on. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so we just got back and I never finished the rest of Let It Shine, so I changed really fast. And I'm going to finish the rest of this movie because it's the best movie to ever exist. And I'm going to eat the leftovers of my sushi. And I'm going to have the best time ever. Jack is currently on the game. So this is my camera died. But I was saying this is what I like to call self-care. So I'm going to go watch my movie. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. I know today was kind of a rough day. It's probably going to be a lot of rough days coming up. But I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.